Yes. Come on. Let's see. Let's start off serious this time. Okay. okay. Um, I love the way you made a dedication with the album. Uh, you want to talk about that a little bit? Yeah, we did. <laughs> we dedicated this album to our brothers and sisters who are living with HIV, and we really think it's important to to create an atmosphere of compassion and understanding and, and more knowledge about this disease. Yeah, so it's nice to know that you all are more than a party band. Where did the whole party band... Every time I hear you introduced, people use that. It's stuck. Where did that start? Woo! Well, we started, <laughs> we started out as a party band. When we first got together, it was basically to entertain ourselves and our friends at a Valentine's Day party. Mm -hmm. And we started... Played the party circuit in Athens three times. And then after that, we figured we don't really have real outgoing personalities on stage, so the best way to keep things going is to create like a party, real up tempo music and get everybody dancing. So the burden of entertainment's not all totally on us. You know, it's a audience participation thing. Yeah, they, I mean, they, they jumped into it immediately. Uh, yes. And you always see the world's greatest party oh. band in front of it. We hope to be. <laughs> Absolutely. No, Brad. <laughs> yeah. We want that title. Are you all uh, voting this year? Oh, you know you it. Bet. Everybody should get out there and vote and push out the bush. <laughs> if, if you had the opportunity to say something to George Bush, like if you could meet him in the room for 10 minutes, what would you say to him? Oh. Why? Good. <laughs> Step aside and let some new ideas into Washington. I think somebody ought to remind him that he's uh, the president, not the king. Ooh. I like that. That should be Clinton's bumper sticker. <laughs> Tell him he ain't. Anyway, uh, <laughs> you uh, have some very strong opinions on abortion. Yeah. Why don't you talk about that for a second? Well, personally, um, I mean, we're all pro-choice. And um, <laughs> personally, I, I wouldn't really have an abortion myself, but I would defend to the death anybody's right to to have an abortion, I think it's really, I would never dream of telling anyone else what to do with their bodies. I think it's, it's a woman's choice to really be able to, to do whatever she wants. And again, Bush, get off my Get off our backs. <laughs> I hope they applaud it through that. Uh, <laughs> no, she said, Bush, get off my um, I, uh... <laughs> I went to the pro-choice march in Washington and I saw that placard everywhere. It was so great. Yeah, yeah. So we should plug these dates, too, because uh, people around the country want to check you guys out. The Spectrum in Philadelphia, that's a big place. I saw Patti LaBelle and Lionel Richie there. Uh, that's a great... And the Philadelphia 76ers play there. That'll be on September 18th. And Mud Island? Huh? <laughs> Just wear Island? mud and dance around. It's really fun. People dance in the mud there. That sounds like a place to party in Memphis on September 25th. So if you're down there, check them out. And we'll be right back. B-52s.